Kill List is basically about, uh, it's a manhunt story, and it's about the hunting down of an Al-Qaeda terrorist, very high on the, on the Kill List, which is uh, not fictional. The Kill List exists in the heart of Washington. There is this list of um, Al-Qaeda terrorists who have been sentenced to death without any due process, any attempt to arrest them or bring them to trial or anything. And this is the story of one of those, uh, the, one of them well, way up there, top of the list, being hunted down and uh, how it's done. You would certainly have recognized Osama bin Laden. He was definitely on it. Um, and one of the most famous was, in fact, the only American citizen who's ever been on it was Anwar Al-Awlaki, who was a half American, half Yemeni. He went back to the land of his fathers, which was Yemen, and became a well, kind of preacher, sermonizer online, um, trying to convince young Muslims here in the West to commit murder. Since I started doing uh, working on the book, actually, two things have happened. The Boston bombing, and uh, in London, the, uh, the hacking to death of an off-duty soldier. In both cases, by what are called clean skins. Uh, this is the counterterrorism word for people they've never even heard of. They uh, apparently have converted themselves inside their own skulls, which is the one place that you know, not, not even uh, the National Security Agency can penetrate. And, uh, and they just kill, um, as they think, for Allah. Uh, and the, the, there's no forewarning that they're coming. And these are the category, uh, actually the worry the counterterrorism people most of all.